fuck did I miss that? You must not have took this trail. I was standing right here. I'm here it's kind of a quick spot so I'm not putting in maximum effort by any means I'm just going for you know pretty close to the road just a short little hike and there's tons of deer around here and I found a lot of sheds right in this area so I'm just gonna go for it for a little bit haven't hit this section yet this year and um, I'm not bringing my pack because I don't I don't think I'm gonna find more than I can carry with my hands if anything so uh plus it's nice just to hike without a pack on sometimes and um anyways it's freezing ass cold but i'm gonna go stomp around in here see what i can find All right, so I've been out for about an hour. Um, I just stopped right here and I pulled my phone out and took a picture because it looks freaking sweet in here. And as I'm putting my phone away, I'm like, that'd be cool if I walk up here and there's a shed in the picture I took. And sure enough, here I walk right up to here and glance over and I'm like, that looks like tine sticking out and confirmed it with the binos that it, there is a nice forky shed laying right there so we'll check it out old one that decent decent forky horn get a pick up on it You mother fucker. All right, let's try that again. Aim's a little off, but. Pretty solid forked horn. Oh, that's kind of cool. Is it got like an eye guard growing off the front. Pretty heavy. A few years old, two or three years old probably. Probably two years. Sweet, Let's see if we can find any more. All right, I finally, me and Michaela been hiking around damn near five miles now and on the trip so far she's got four and I finally just found a little chalk dink about 20 minutes ago and going through this timber stuff that looks super good in here and I finally just walked up on a hard white four point it looks like with an eye guard uh, looks super good in here I'm pretty positive there's more but uh, I'm stoked to finally get something decent so we'll walk up to her Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yes, that's a nice one. Like last year's brown too. 
still got some good color underneath. That might be two years old. Cracking a little bit, but heavy. It's got good weight to it. What's up? It's March 13th. It's about 10:15 a.m. Uh, I'm at a spot that I've never shed hunted at all before. Never even hiked down into here, but uh, it looks looks really good. See a lot of deer in this area. Uh, it looks like it's pretty. There's some swampy stuff down here, grassy little patches. So it looks good. Looks really good actually for both deer or elk. So I'm gonna hike down in here a little bit, look around, check some of this shit out, see if I can find anything. It's really wet and cold, but I'm gonna go for it anyways until I get sick of it. But I got a couple spots in mind I wanna try to hit today, so, and I might check my trail camera as well. So we'll see uh, if I find anything. Just spooked a couple deer out of right in here, but man, it looks good. Hopefully, I can find something back here. There's more swampy stuff right down in here, but I'm gonna go check this out. Look through here, loop around. Hopefully, pick something up. Well, that's it for the first spot. <laughs> Nothing. It was looked super good in there. A lot of, a lot of sign, some rubs in there from like this past rut, um, nice bull rubs, but uh, looked like a good spot to set up a trail camera. I might have to do that this coming year, but no sheds, I don't know. So I'm gonna, almost to the rig, and I'm gonna go try a different spot. So we'll update if I find anything there. All right, not sure how the footage is gonna look in here. It's pretty dark, but uh, dark in this in this timber at least. Um, anyways, I just walking through here and I just stumbled on a deadhead, elk deadhead. I'm just walking through here and I saw this old bone. Walked a little further over here. I got to right here and just happened to look over and see that. That was pretty cool. Sucks finding them like this, but still pretty cool. Sure, how good you can see that, but hopefully, you can see it. Nice little four point. Alright guys, I just got a shed, finally. I've been 
going through this stuff here zigzagging through it like really good and it looks amazing in here but I haven't found anything yet and I was like how in the hell there has to be something in here and it's freaking pouring down rain now but I'm just walking through here still zigzagging and uh, I peeked up through here and there's a shed laying right there it looks pretty old but it looks big so I'm pretty stoked to get something finally found that deadhead but that was it so far but this looks very nice eh, looks like a good three point buried all right I'll get a pickup on it Stud three point. Heavy. Really old, but super nice buck. Let's see if I can't maybe find the other side or find some more in here. All right. Not quite done yet. I just walking up to the road, which is literally right here. And I just happened to peek down and something caught my eye down there. Tine sticking out. I'm like, that does not look like a branch. That has to be a shed. So I'm going to go pick it up. Go look at it. It looks like a big forked horn buck, but it's pretty old once again. But I'll take it. Yeah, maybe it's not as big as I thought. It looked huge from up there. And yeah, not very big, but sweet. A little baby, baby three on the back, reverse three point. Not near as big as I thought it was from up there, but shed's a shed. I'll take it. Decent one. Sweet.